stand at ease in about 30 minutes. Okay. We're going to stand at ease in about 30 minutes. So we can get started. Uh, we were going to take up Mr. Price's bill, um, 2304, uh, next. So we could get started, if you, if you would like to do that, Chairman. And then, uh, you know, we've got a good number of witnesses. We can go through some of them, and then we will stand at ease, like I said, in about 30 minutes, more or less, uh, and then finish up the bill. So is that okay? All right, Chair recognizes Chairman Price. Uh, Chair calls up House Bill 2304. And we have a substitute? Yes. Chair lays out committee substitute to House Bill 2304 and recognizes Chairman Ford Price to explain the bill. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. House Bill or the committee substitute to House Bill 2304 is the sunset bill for the Health and Human Services Commission, the umbrella agency that oversees five independent agencies that make up our health and human services system. This bill aligns the system, makes it more efficient, and functionally aligns programs to better meet the needs of Texans who rely on these services. Specifically, this bill consolidates administrative functions, something that has been required in current law but has never actually been completed. It realigns other parts of the system along functional lines, consolidating at HHSC, Medicaid, and other client service programs, state institutions, and regulatory functions which are currently spread across three agencies. And it also establishes a transition legislative oversight committee to monitor the reorganization and report on that progress to the legislature. The bill makes other improvements in the Medicaid program and for public and stakeholder involvement. Specifically, this bill eliminates duplicative and outdated advisory committees. It strengthens oversight of managed care organizations. It makes improvements to the Medicaid provider enrollment process and it streamlines websites and hotlines. The Sunset Commission made its decisions in early December 2014. Since that time, two new reports have, it, have been issued, one from the State Auditor and another from the Governor's Strike Force. All three reports paint a picture of a system that is broken. The House substitute reflects the Senate in gross version of the bill and incorporates many suggestions from both the Strike Force report and the State Auditors, which takes a more graduated approach to realignment. The committee substitute transfers the functions of the Department of Assistive and Rehabilitative Services, other than those transferring to the Workforce Commission, to HHSC on September 1, 2016. It transfers the functions of DADS, or the Department of Aging and Disability Services, to HHSC by September 1, 2017. <coughs> it continues the Department of Family and Protective Services as an independent agency. It maintains the Department of State Health Services as an independent agency as well, but narrows its focus on the core mission of improving public health. And it gives more time for the planning phase, requiring the Executive Commissioner to submit a detailed transition plan to the Oversight Committee by March 1, 2016, before any reorganization can begin. The graduated approach also allows for a legislative session in between the two major transition phases, giving the legislature more opportunity to monitor and oversee the transitions. Our number one goal with this realignment is to make it easier for citizens to navigate what is currently a broken system and no longer reflects the reality of how services are actually delivered. This bill creates a more efficient enterprise with a clearly defined point of entry and one that will better meet the needs of our most vulnerable citizens. Members, uh, both the Sunset Review and the Strike Force Report conclude that the current structure we have isn't working and isn't working efficiently. So that is the goal of this bill. Uh, services are fragmented across the system and not only is that inefficient, it's very confusing for the people who are trying to connect with these services. Those are the major highlights of this bill. I know we have Sarah Kirkle here from Sunset uh, staff. Uh, Where's Sarah? And be Why happy to yield for any questions. Why don't you come sit up there? Or up there, whichever you. Sarah, do you want to sit there? Or whichever one you want. Members, do you have any uh, questions for anybody? <coughs> 